Explosions were heard in the temporarily occupied Crimea. The explosions allegedly took place at the Long Range Space Communications Center of the Russian Aerospace Forces. According to the information received, the first attack took place in Alutsha at around 4 o'clock in the morning. At the same time, according to open data, at least three attacks were recorded on the territory of the FSB military unit located in the village of Sonatorske. The attack was first carried out by a UAV. One FSB officer was injured and a satellite communication antenna was damaged, it is reported. The next attack was carried out at 5 o'clock in the morning with Storm Shadow missiles on the 40th separate command and measurement complex, which is part of the main test space center named after GS Taito of the Russian Aerospace Forces, located in the village of Vitino in the Sakis region. At least two attacks were recorded on the territory of the center. One unit of military equipment was damaged. There were no casualties. Attack operations on Russian-controlled areas and areas where Russian troops are concentrated have recently increased. The Russians cannot prevent this situation. Do you think Ukraine's successful operations will continue to increase? Ukrainian defenders have carried out dozens of operations on the peninsula and in the Black Sea, destroying Russian bases, warehouses and ships. Recently, President Volodymyr Zelensky suggested that it would be easier to liberate Crimea from occupation than Donbass. According to him, it is not only about the liberation of the regions, but also about the general mood of the population. 